Hey YouTube, welcome to my super, super, super cold day, winter day today. It's like minus 13, but there's a wind blowing from over there. Woo, are my ears cold? I'm gonna put on another hat in a second, but I've got my master air screw hat on because today we're gonna take a look at, can you see them here? These are the new master air screw props. Get them in the picture. Well, you're gonna see a close up of them in a little bit. These are designed for the Mavic 2, so Mavic 2 Zoom, Mavic 2 Pro. And uh, they are quality props because they're from Master Air Screw. You'll see what I mean when I show them close up. They have a different uh, noise. I'm going to use the word noise. So noise is, you know, it's subjective to all of us. What's noisy to you might not be noisy to me. When it comes to the sound of drones, a lot of people do find them to be quite noisy. And uh, what Master Air Screw does is offers props in different colors, which is pretty cool. There's a lot of colors. And what they do is they take the pitch of the props and they bring that pitch from high pitch all the way down to a lower pitch. So most humans, we do not like high pitch sounds. It drives us up the wall, but lower pitch sounds, we seem to be okay with. So that's basically all they do. So first off, let me just show you what comes in the box and all the other good stuff. Check this out. As you can see here, Master Air Screw sent me four boxes, four different colors. We have white, blue, black, and orange. Let me show you quickly what comes in the box. Inside the box, just like always, you get a nice carry bag. It's always high quality. Check that out. You also get Master Air Screw stickers and you get the instruction sheet. Check out how they do it inside the bag. So your bag has placeholders in the top for a set and another set, and then you have placeholders on the bottom for the other two sets. They are foldable props, very nice shiny plastic. Let's take a close look at the center hinge. You can see on the DJI center hinge right here, you can see the metal rivets going right through and it is quite small. On the master air screw, the metal rivets are shown in black and uh, it's much larger. Let me flip it over so you can see them. There you go, you can see them there. And if I flip over the DJI one, you can see large metal rivets here and much smaller ones on the DJI props. All right, I have my calipers here and the DJI prop and let's measure the thickest piece of plastic, which was right closest to the center. And what do we have? 2.38. Same thing on the master air screw. Let's measure the thickest part right at closest center. Ooh, this is much thicker, 3.47. DJI prop, how wide is it? Let me just take this. There we go, that's the widest spot. And I have 25.99. Master air screw, let's check the widest spot. Looks to be about there. So what do I have? 24.91. Now what I'm gonna do is put each color prop on my Mavic 2 so you can see what the color looks like. All right, now I'm gonna show you what I mean by the difference in sound pitch. I'm gonna fly both of these indoors in my house where it's nice and quiet with a really high quality microphone. And the most important thing is listen with your ears. If you're not over the age of 80, you should hear a difference in pitch. If you're really young, you're gonna hear a big difference, but the older we get, you know, our ears get kind of, kind of terrible, so pitch isn't that great. But anyways, you'll hear the DJI props are a little bit higher pitch than the Master Air Screw props. So here, listen. All right, did you hear a difference in pitch? I certainly did. So next thing to do is to watch my ears fall off because they are now frozen. But uh, before that happens, let me just show you this here. I'm gonna take this here, Mavic 2 Pro, and I'm gonna try to fly it. I think it. I think it'll start up in this cold weather. Uh, I'm gonna try to fly it and uh, just see if I notice any errors or anything like that on my uh, phone as I fly it around. So let's check this out now. All right, props, will you start up in this cold weather? Oh, thank God. <laughs> let's take it up. Woohoo! She goes nicely. I'll bring it down so you can see the colors of the props. I have white on the back and blue in the front. There you go. I don't know if you can really see the colors, but uh, there it is, a little bit of color through it. It does sound quieter. Here, let me just bend down. I'm gonna get very quiet. I'm very close to the props. I'm very quiet, listen. That sounds very quiet. I don't think anybody would even hear this drone. It's very quiet. So uh, yeah, much quieter than I thought. Let me just take it forward and fly it here. Flies no problem. I'll just spin it around the parking lot here nicely. It's coming to me. Whip it over my head, over the trees. Beautiful. 
I love the Mavic 2. Mavic 2 has got such awesome potential for doing so many cool things. I see no problems, no anything with these props. They are just awesome. Like I can just spin this thing around, whip it down the parking lot here doing all sorts of crazy stuff. No issues whatsoever. All right, let's bring this down for a landing. Works great. All right, trying to get super warm here. <laughs> it is so cold. All right, so that was my super quick review of these Master Air Screw props. I think they're frozen. Everything's frozen. So uh, go and check them out on the website. I don't know what the price is. I don't get any discounts. Like if you buy a hundred of them, I get zero dollars. I'm not affiliated with Master Air Screw. They did send me a hat, but uh, I have no affiliation, nothing. So anyways, if you want to get colored props for your Mavic 2 with a pitch that's a little bit lower, then go and get these ones. If not, stick with your original ones and you'll be just as happy. All right, guys, thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and I will see you in warmer weather.